if a woman friend zones you after you worked hard to pursue her, like you actually were pursuing this particular woman, and she friend zones you, that's not a woman that you want to be cool with. All right, gentlemen, we're going to go ahead and talk about the benefits of having female friends, meaning platonic friendships. Now, gentlemen, here's a disclaimer. I just want to let y'all know this. If a woman friend zones you after you worked hard to pursue her, like you actually were pursuing this particular woman, and she friend zones you, that's not a woman that you want to be cool with. Keep that out. That's, that's Those are the ones you cut off. But the ones that are genuinely your friends, that there is no physical attraction that y'all have, y'all got nothing going on, those are the female friends that you want to have. This particular video, gentlemen, the reason why I'm making it is because I have platonic female friends that I deeply care about, that, that are people that I really rock with. You know, these are people that I don't play about, you know what I'm saying? And because they've helped me in my lowest seasons and I'm gonna help them in their lowest seasons. And I don't care whatever opportunity presents itself, I would even do that because I truly value uh, my friendship with some of these women, okay? And some of them are attractive, you know what I'm saying? So just because they're attractive don't mean that they're uh, an option to smash. Because there's so many benefits of having female friends, and I think a lot of guys tend to forget. Because, gentlemen, let me tell you something. When you have an attractive female friend, I'm talking about platonic, y'all not doing nothing, you're more likely to get other girls. You know what I'm saying? Um, you got Y'all got to understand the term of pre-selection. Pre-selection. So, women like men that can handle themselves without trying to smash something. And to be honest with y'all fellas, man, I'm telling y'all. There's so many benefits with female friends. And in this particular video, gentlemen, I'm going to go ahead and tell you 10 major benefits of having female friends. Y'all tune in. Benefit number one, you truly understand female nature. You understand the hidden agenda. They, uh, female friends, when you have a, 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 an attractive female friend that y'all have no sexual attraction, like there's nothing going on, but obviously she's attractive. You can really tap into female nature. Right, especially with attractive women, because attractive women tend to get a lot of attention from both men and women. So when you have that friend, she's gonna put you on some game on female nature, stuff that we wouldn't tap into, stuff that we wouldn't understand. And honestly, gentlemen, for this to work, you can't have any hidden agenda behind this because they're gonna give you uh, a different perspective. Now, if you were with a female friend that you, you know, low key, she knew that you were attracted to her, that you low key, she low key knew that you would smash if the opportunity presented itself, then she wouldn't put you on game the way a real female friend would put you on game about. So understanding female nature from a different perspective, because again, we are men, right? And we see things from a rational standpoint. We try to understand female nature. We, most guys, not most guys, but there are guys who understand female nature, but at the same time, you know, speaking to a female friend and she's giving you the real, bold, honest truth about the female brain, then it helps a whole lot. And, you know, I'll be in certain situations and having that female friend, she gives you a different perspective. Women can tell whether a girl ain't shit or not. Women can tell by that. They truly can tell. And I truly want you fellas to really understand. I know a lot of y'all like, man, Joe, what are you talking about? You know, I'm, I'm smashing anything. What's the point of having female friends? What are the benefits? What am I gaining? Trust me, you are gaining a whole lot. I'm not saying you want to, you know, befriend every girl in the world. I'm not saying that. But you have a set few female friends that are attractive that can help you attain more women. I'm telling you. So I want y'all to just think about this benefit. You know, so you get to understand a female's mind, especially an attractive female, female mind who gets guys, right? Who gets attention. So she's giving you a perspective of what how, what they go through and some of the things that they, they struggle with and how they navigate through life. You know what I'm saying? For I'm going to give you guys an example. You know, what is it like uh, your DMs being, being, you know, when a guy slides in your DMs? Like, what is what goes through your mind when you see it? Now, every girl is different, but universally... Generally, most girls operate the same way, especially when they're attractive. You know what I'm saying? And she's giving me the real. You know, so that first benefit, gentlemen, understanding female nature from a woman's perspective is uh, definitely beneficial. So I just told you guys the first benefit of having a female friend. Number two. Number two is related to the first one and being able to be fully transparent 
without needing to spare feelings or lessen your chances of getting in her pants. So this relates to the first benefit, right? When a woman isn't attracted to you, right? And when she's not attracted to you and you guys have an established friendship, not talking about friendship and you doing stuff on the side and fooling around and messing around. No, no, no. Friendship where you're not hanging out past a certain time because you understand the dynamics of that. You you truly not even just a certain time. I take that back. You truly respect each other like you truly would not do anything with this particular woman. She's going to give you the true, honest answer. She's going to be completely blunt with you. And there'll be times where some of my female friends will tell me, look, man, I'm telling you from a woman perspective, if you keep doing what you're doing with this woman, you better. It's, it's going to hurt you. She's going to go crazy. If you keep doing what you're doing, she's going to go crazy. Trust me, I'm a woman. We're emotional. This is how we operate. And you dudes don't operate in motion. So you have to see things from that perspective. Yeah, you may say, yeah, you know, you may be rational and tell your expectations. But her mind, she tells herself otherwise. So even sometimes, gentlemen, we all get in these situations. We've all been there where we would... You know, say, for example, if you're in a season where you're just having a good time, gentlemen, you're in a season where you're having a good time and you're just, you know, focus on your path, you're not looking for nothing serious, you know, you come across somebody and you tell her straight up, like, hey, man, this is where I'm at, I'm not looking for nothing serious, blah, 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 right? And then she'll end up telling you, like, oh, yeah, no problem, you know, I'm not going to catch no feelings, blah, blah, blah. But you end up engaging in sexual activity with her, you end up spending time with her, a lot of time with her talking to her on the phone. You know, feeding her this false hope. In her mind, she's thinking, dang, I think he likes me because he's consistent. He calls me. He talks to me. You know, we have a great time. You know, we vibe well. I think he really likes me. But in actuality, you don't really like her. Y'all just having a good time. So you don't want to confuse that because you're going to awake something crazy. And that's what my female, one of my female friends, I'm not going to say her name, but she put me on game and told me, like, you got to slow down. Like, you have to slow down, and I learned. I'm like, yeah, she's definitely right, because the last thing I want to do is wake up the craziness within women, because, you know, they get a little crazy. So that is the number two benefit, gentlemen. They will be fully transparent with you, and definitely transparency definitely helps when it comes to female playtime friendships. Number three, it balances out the masculinity. Now, gentlemen, I'm going to be real with you. I read the book, The Way to Superior Man, and they talk about that. And I think every man, for the most part, needs to be masculine. But we all have a feminine side, a feminine essence to us. Everybody has a masculine and feminine essence. Some have more, some have less, right? Depending on who you are. But what I'm trying to tell you, gentlemen, is you have to balance that masculinity. At times, if we're ultra-masculine and we're always hanging out with our guy friends and we're not hanging out with any type of feminine estrogen you're going to be too the testosterone is going to be too high um you're going to be a little too rough um and you won't have a sense of easiness you won't have a sense of calmness because women naturally are calm individuals right they're very nurturing that nurturing side i'm not saying you're supposed to be nurturing i'm not saying you're supposed to be nurturing but there's certain ways to balance out that masculinity and it, it, it keeps that masculinity in check not i'm not saying simp i'm not saying be a beta i'm saying there's got to be a balance and, and, and it's healthy for, for the way we live life. Because if you're always hanging out with dudes and you're like, yeah, man, F these girls, blah, blah, blah. You're going to be ultra masculine. And it's going to get to a point where you're too rough. And you won't be able to attain a quality woman or woman that you desire because you're too masculine. There's got to be a certain ease and calmness about you. You got to be a little smooth. You know what I'm saying? Especially when you're getting intimate. You know, the foreplay. You know, the touching and the rubbing. Women love that. That's what gets them going. But if you're one of those type of dudes that likes to rush and, and you want to go crazy and you're not going to get the best results and she's and you're going to have women end up leaving you. So that's why it's important you have a balance. You balance out that masculinity to keep that manpower and control from time to time. Like I said, for the most part, you want to be primarily masculine. You want to, for the most part, you want to be masculine all the time, most of the time. But there's got to be some estrogen and feminine essence to you to balance out that masculinity. So... That's why that's number three benefit of having a female friend is to balance out that masculinity. Number four, women are very good with task and business stuff. I mean, women are some of the best assistants ever. So women are some of the best when it comes to content creation, 
Women are some of the best when it comes to organization. Women are the best when it comes to taking pictures and videos. Oh my gosh. One thing I learned from my previous relationship five years ago is how to take pictures from the best angles. My ex-girlfriend would taught me so much as far as how to take pictures, the best angles. And not saying, she, I mean, we were together, but what I'm saying is some of the benefits of having a female is they have the female touch where they understand the angles and the videoing and how to lay out and how pictures look because women are very good when it comes to aesthetics. So they're good with consecration. For example, like gentlemen, when I shoot videos, the beauty of having a woman record and give you some feedback on how, you know, certain outlines and how your page should be formatted. Those are things that women are really good at. And when you have that female friend where you, where there's no emotional or intimate attachment, y'all can take, she can take your pictures. She can, record videos all that good stuff gentlemen she will be great as as far as like an addition to your um content creation team so women are really good when it comes to task and business so if you're a content creator it is essential that you have a female friend that can help you help assist you with some of the aesthetics and the the just the little details because women are very detail oriented when it comes to their, their aesthetics even with hair products gentlemen i grew up with you know, mom and aunt and, you know, they're very, you know, they're the ones who influenced me when it came to products, you know, hair products. And that's why I got beard products and stuff like that for days. So that's why it's very important, gentlemen, that you understand that you can benefit uh, from women when it comes to tasks and businesses. Number five, it attracts other women. But the only thing is your female friend has to be somewhat attractive. OK, when she's somewhat attractive. And other attractive women see that, they're going to want to come on to you, right? And for some reason, whenever I post any woman on my Instagram store or whatever it is, they get a lot of clicks. There's an analytic that shows you how many times a person clicked, um, clicked a link or a tab or whatever. And so many women are curious when it comes to seeing, when they see you with another female, they are extremely curious. So, gentlemen, I'm telling you. It's a crazy thing. It's a crazy psychology. But when they see you with other women, that attracts them to you. They're curious, okay, what is this guy doing with all these girls? Or what is this guy doing with her? Is he hitting her? What is he exactly doing? So those are things that we have to take in consideration and think, okay, if I'm hanging out with my attractive female friend at nighttime, I would say the probability of you getting other women is very, very high. I promise you. I promise you. I promise you. Every time I hang out with my female friends, I get more girls from hanging out with them because they will pull other women. And then, and then other girls will be like, OK, girl, who is that? Oh, that's my homeboy. Y'all doing anything? Nah, we're not doing nothing. You can have them. Oh, word. OK. And that shows if you're able. And the thing is, with other women, when they see that you're able to handle yourself and control yourself around another attractive woman, that attracts them. And they're going to be curious and see what kind of guy are you? And that's how you land yourself. So. That's one of the benefits is you get other women. Gentlemen, if you find any value in this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. And gentlemen, gentlemen, if you find any value in this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. And gentlemen, check out my weekly Patreon for more exclusive content. And gentlemen, if you're going through any particular struggle where you feel stuck in life, where you feel unmotivated, book a session with me. Link is in the description box, and I promise you, you're going to get some good game from me, and we're going to make sure you become a superior man through strategy and weekly check-ins. Peace from Jay the Professor.